Hello and Satrikal. My name is Upkar Grewal. I am Settlement Coordinator at SOIX. Coming up next is the henna demonstration by Sugun. She has this special talent in applying beautiful and intricate designs of henna. Henna is also called Mandi in Punjabi. From ancient times, Mandi has been used for its medicinal value, aesthetic value and its aroma. It is such an integral part of our culture and tradition that in the Indian subcontinent, there is a special pre-wedding ceremony called Mehendi ceremony. It is typically held a day before the wedding and during this time, Mehendi is applied to the bride's hands and feet. Now I would like to welcome Sugun. She will demonstrate how we can apply Mehendi on hands and also share some important tips or tricks to care for Mehendi color. You can follow her on Instagram page, The Henna Republic, shared in the comments below. Namaste. My name is Sugun and I'm from India. I'll be talking about Hina today. Hina is an Arabic term and is tied to a lot of cultures and religions, but it is predominantly used in India where it's also called as Mehendi. I will be demonstrating the application of Hina on my dear friend Upkar for you all today. When Hina leaves are grounded to make a paste and applied on hands, it leaves a beautiful reddish orange stain. This color and stain is associated with positive spirits and good luck in the Indian culture. It's like a beautiful temporary tattoo. In ancient times, henna designs were not this intricate and were made by using twigs. Henna powder was mixed in water to make a thick paste and left for a few hours before applying. Nowadays, this paste is added to a cone with a thin tip, just like the pastry decoration tube and later applied. These days, we can get pre-made henna cones from Indian grocery stores and it is so convenient. Henna is a crucial part of many Indian celebrations, including Diwali, Eid, engagements and weddings. Indian wedding tradition calls for a mehendi ceremony to be held the night before the wedding. This is the way of wishing the bride good health and prosperity as she enters a new phase in her life. In some cultures, it's said that the darker the henna stain is, the deeper the love between two individuals is. In the olden era, henna paste was used to provide help for blood circulation and is still used as a natural dye for hair color. It is said that the application of mehendi can help with stress because it cools the body and keeps the nerves from becoming tense. It was originally used for its natural cooling properties for people living in the hot desert climates. A paste would be made in which the palms of the hand and sole of the feet would be soaked. It was also used for medicinal purposes and applied to skin to treat ailments such as stomach aches, burns, headaches and open wounds. In the ancient Egyptian times, even mummies wore henna designs. And it is documented that Cleopatra herself used henna for decorative purposes. In India, women look forward to sitting down with Mehendi artists and the whole act of Mehendi decoration is a wonderful experience in itself. Also, it becomes a very good excuse to avoid household work as it takes about an hour to dry and for it to leave a darker stain, you have to leave it on for a couple of hours. Henna is a beautiful custom that has become a part of our celebrations here in Canada. We hope that you have an opportunity to participate and enjoy this beautiful artistic expression of tradition. <laughs>